Before the video begins, I'd like to thank the people listed on the screen right now for supporting me on Patreon. Welcome to Let's Play NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup Part 183, and it is now time to begin Season 4 of the Career Mode. Also, hi, slightly updated uh, video stream look. Cool? Yeah? Cool. Alright, so, we have a lot of shit to take care of here. Um, I got a lot of, uh, you know, offers for stuff, so... First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the Bush series because that's kind of the most important thing. Going to check out our contracts here. So these are the contracts we were offered for the next Bush season, including another ride in the cobbler. Get to take over Dale Jr.'s Bush car, but I'm not going to take any of those. Instead, I'm going to start my own team. Ooh, a cool 1.5 million. But now I have my own Bush series team. Oh yeah. So, let's, uh, let's, let's just fully screw it. Just, just make our crew chief one badass mofo. Um, yeah, get, get a sponsor here. Let's see, we got Dangler's Bait Shop, Nugget Ranch, and Levi Strauss. And Levi is going to give us the most money, so guess what? We're going with Levi Strauss, yeah! Woo! Alright, and then, last things last, is to fully upgrade the car, because, of course, I have the money for that. 300000 There we go. So, still over a million dollars left. And, yeah. No camera, that's not how that works. That's unique followers at the top. Um, Alright, now for the hard part. Actually designing the car. It's gonna be fun. So, we can choose between Chevy Dodge, Ford, uh... Let's drive a Chevrolet, why not? Get my car number. Then we have a lot of different livery styles, I'm sure a lot more than the truck, and also some different ones. Just kind of glance over these. Flames. Safari, I have no idea what I'm going to make this car look like, but... I'll, I'll fucking do something. Simple. Shout out to Simple Flips. Curves. Subtle curves. There's a lot of different livery uh, things here. Sorry. There's that. If I can, I keep that. And sure, let's let's put some decals on it. Okay. Driver gear. Baseball cap. Gotta get the flame suit and the cool shades course. Alright, anyways, in terms of the actual livery, I, I'll, I'll be right back make this shit. Okay, well, we got our car. There we go. So, using the basic livery with this shit. I basically went with a, a team a Corvette racing design since I'm driving a Chevy. I can't choose the sponsor's GS, also I wouldn't do that anyways. So yeah. Here's my bush car for at least the first race. We'll decide if I still want to continue driving it looking like this after that. So, yeah, there's that. That's finally done. And then there's merch, and uh, you know what? We, we also got a new merch type, a diecast. Ooh. So let's just let's just slightly raise the price of everything. Why not? And there we go. I think I think our bush car is ready. Now we just need to get the rest of our shit ready. So, sorry with the modified. First, we need to sign a new sponsor since our old sponsor, uh, Cletus, I think it was, did not want to re sign. And let's go with Jed's Campground since it's giving me the most money. So, do that. It's gonna keep the livery the same because I don't really care. Uh, I'm gonna keep McCoy in the. Actually, you know what? Let's hire Payne. Let's, let's get a slightly better driver. Why not? It's gonna cost me another twelve hundred per race, but still, twelve dollar could I cast? That's cheap as fuck. All right. So there we go. Modified set. Now this is gonna be the interesting part. My truck. Since I'm, you know, won the truck championship with my own, my own truck, I'm not gonna be participating in all the races. Also, I'm just gonna go ahead and re-sign with Old Spice. Um, but I am going to uh, run a few races, truck races, 
in the hopes of getting the tr winner's trophies for those, because there's, you know, the truck trophy case isn't completely full. As far as a driver, we have, well, they're going to cost more money because we're in a higher up series, but I'm going to go ahead and hire Murphy for this. So, yeah, yeah. So there we go. So Murphy's going to run most of the truck schedule for me, and everything else should be just hunky-dory. So there you go. There's my updated garage. Three very different cars with three very different liveries on them. Yeah. Awesome. Not bad. So, with all that shit out of the way, let's move on to our first actual race of the season. And that is going to be the Hershey's Kisses 300 at Daytona International Race Speedway. Not Raceway, Speedway. Anyways, let's go away to Daytona. EA Sports would like to welcome you to today's exciting Bush Series racing from sunny Daytona Beach. Now, a victory always means a little more here on the high banks of the Daytona International Speedway. And these NASCAR Bush Series drivers are going to be giving it all they have here today. A good finish at Daytona will help get your season off on the right foot. And 43 drivers are about to put their right foot to the floor as the start of today's racing action is just moments away. All right, nice intro, Weber. Anyways, so you probably already saw I qualified on the pole. Um, yeah, car's fast. That's <laughs> what happens when you have a fully upgraded car immediately. Car's fast. And of course, the big boys are starting in the back, like Hornaday and Harvick, because of course they are. But here we go. It is time to race at Daytona. Thirty laps in our Bush Curs. And I think I made the black part of my car too black. Uh, I think I should make it a little less black. So I think that's one change I am going to make. Uh, after this race to delivery. Careful. I just realized I forgot to show the fucking the cup offers I had. It's okay, I wasn't intending on taking any offers, but whatever. I have to remember to show that in the next segment. I knew I was forgetting something. Always forgetting something. That's racist. I know, right? Go, go, go. May have been fast to qualifying, but that doesn't matter in the race. Got that nice push, though, from Dwayne behind me. Good old Dwayne the Rock Borlin. I like to call him. Oh, God. I moved up too much. Shit. Dwayne, help me. Help your fellow mustard boy out. Is it weird the colors on this thing look too color? Like, they, they look too much color-y. I think I need to go with some slightly fit more faded colors. In general. <laughs> Get ready for this to be half the races in 2019. Good thing I'm going to watch not NASCAR. As long as Darlington is still a good race, that's all I care about. Darlington is the only cup race I care about. Not too much color. It looks more like it looks less Team Corvette and more Team Mustard. So excuse me, taking the lead back. Thank you, Dwayne, for your uh, contribution. Now it's time to block for the rest of the first half of this race. Yeah, Team Heinz. Then the next race, I just make it really freaking red. <clears throat> the ketchup car. 
Hey guys, look who's behind me. It's it's a uh, defending champion Kyle Busch. Guess who's not going to succeed in defending his title if I have anything to say about it? Kyle Busch. That's you no, know, of course that's our goal this season is to win the Bush title. Then hopefully earn enough money <clears throat> to start my own Cup team next season. I'm really hoping that I can get a uh, good Cup ride offer. And by good, I mean good enough for to satisfy my cravings, earn some more money. Our team is making a 97-98 GT mod. Ooh, that's pretty neat to racer. By pretty neat, I mean really neat. No, I'm giving up the bottom. <clears throat> I'll be glad when this race is over so I can go to my first actual race of the season. I don't even consider Daytona and Talladega races anymore. It's just traffic jams. Hey look, it's rush hour, 200 mile per hour, ain't that fucking cool? Oh, everybody wrecked. Making the wing for the 98 Mustang. Look at you, Geraser, professional modder. How does it make you feel to be the hacker man? Nugget Ranch. I want some nuggets. I just had a freaking big ass tender one sandwich. To race to the bathroom. That was the most exciting race during that, uh. <clears throat> the JPM red flag at Daytona. The, the bathroom race. Oh, jeez. Almost caused huge problems there. I don't know, I found humor in that, Cameron. <laughs> Mostly because I related it to a thing that actually happened. Whoa, and here comes Casey Atwood out of nowhere. Holy crap. Going three wide way on the bottom. Just suddenly. Here come the Navy. Oh, nice bias eraser. How dare. How dare you, you want to use something you contributed in making. Actually happened, yeah. Right at long ass red flag from the, uh, you know, the infamous Montoya crash from the Daytona 500. There, there were a couple, there was at least one foot race to the bathroom. I'm not sure if there were two. Oh god. And there goes Borland and Atwood around the outside. Around the outside. Around the outside. Here comes a Kyle Bush around the outside. It kind of sucks that this game doesn't update like rookie striping and stuff. Because <coughs> Kyle still has the rookie stripes on his car. I know it's literally just like delivery texture that they decided to use and for the car, which sucks, but eh, whatever. Oh, fuck! I need to turn my speakers down. Also, thank you for the 100 bits, Sob. I appreciate that. I also appreciate the very huge accident that just happened to my heart. Also, speaking of a huge accident, what happened behind me? Suddenly, five-car breakaway. There seem to have been some, uh, shenanigans. Who's this kind of bush asshole? I don't know. Probably won't amount to much, though. Haha. -ha. Well. This race has, uh, become vastly different now. With whatever happened behind us happening. And, uh, yeah, there's Kyle being Kyle. Sounds like he'll become be 
yeah, the most hated NASCAR driver. Clearly. I don't know. I think he I think he might beat Dale Jr. for most popular driver for the first time ever. I'm not sure about you. I think he has potential. Be a really beloved driver of the cup uh, garage. He heavily defends his position on me. I don't know why I looked, oh yeah, I don't know why I looked to the outside, I tried to bait him to the outside so I could swing low. Sweet Kyle Bush. Also, I'm not share drafting here just because the share draft kind of hurts me. I think I mentioned this last at some point last season, AI actually pretty get a pretty good, or the guy I'm share drafting gets a pretty good speed boost that does more harm than good, especially in this application, where drafting is kind of, like, needed in order to, uh, stay up here. Hey, don't even on really Twitch. Uh, there's a, uh, in the info section down below, if you're not, well, I don't know where it is on mobile, but there's a, uh, donation link <coughs> down below in the info section. Or alternative, alternatively, you can just donate bits, but still. Oh god! Okay, <laughs> it's fine. Everything's okay. M minor uh, tussle with Casey there, and well, I ruined that. I tried to sneak underneath Casey. I shouldn't have done that. Should have just stayed behind him. I mean, I'm gonna. <clears throat> I'm gonna hopefully have a uh, massive lead after a pit cycle because I'm taking doing the two tire strat. Oh shit! Touching the apron. That could have been bad. Could have been really bad. Get back here, Kyle. Get back here, Kyle. We kind of broke away from the pack due to accidents, so, uh, you know. Kyle, you're not helping. <laughs> That's fantastic, Tracer. Well, Kyle's gone. I guess it's going to be a lonely ride until my uh, first pit or er, first pit stop, my first and only pit stop. Fuck, I agree, Q. Oh, uh, apparently, there's something else called a thousand. I I don't even fucking know. Oh, that that's a thousand miles. Okay. That's <laughs> Fuck, I need to turn down my speakers. Hi, Angel. And everyone from Angel's stream. Thank you for the raid. How you doing? And it's just a... It's just a minor... Sponsor. Not the primary sponsor. Q, oh my god, that's a wall. And here's a bunch of guys that just exited from pit lane. And this is kind of jumping my beans here. Gotta be careful here. King Kyle has a two and a half second lead now. I see a Casey Atwood and also a lot of other people. Push me. Push me, Casey. Jumping my beans today. You're not helping, Mr. Atwood. I mean, I know I almost caused a massive crash between you and I, but still. I see. All right. Well, thank you again, Angel, for the raid. All right, going into pits now. Let's just try to not get caught speeding. So 
70 miles per hour. There we go. All right, so right side tires and everything else can stay the same. <clears throat> well, thank you, Angel. I was hoping it would look less bad. A few rounds away. If you say he does, then it does. Yeah. I really wish I could get some like actual face lighting instead of relying on my TV to light my face. <clears throat> All right, there we go. Two tires done. Go. Hopefully that gives me the advantage I need to win the race. Just get a lamp or a facial. I mean, I have a lamp, it's just over on my nightstand. On the other side of the room. This cup or cup for pussies. Uh, th this is a uh, this is a cup for men who drink beer, as in the Bush series. Hi, Sam. This is gonna be interesting to see how much of an advantage I've got out of here. Oh, considering that's Kyle right behind me, not much. At least I got the lead though. Here comes Twat Boy really quickly, though. But it's only between myself and Kyle, so I can do all the stupid blocking tactics I need to. Racing is racing. No. Now I'm saving that for after the career Corvette. No you don't, Kyle. I will defend this goddamn lead. Damn it, Sam. Do your homework. Fucker. Do it. Google Earth being a pain in the ass. Yeah, because you know it, it, they uh, they think it's a globe. No, it's not flat. Something something flat Earth joke. It's not homework. It's smut. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, then yeah, take take all the distractions you can get. <clears throat> Don't fuck boy around. I'll make an attempt. No guarantees. The rest of the field's quickly closing in. And there's still 11 laps to go. This is going to require some expert blocking. I'm expecting a challenge when I get to that shit. It's the name Dodge Challenge, huh? <laughs> Ten to go. <clears throat> In the fucking yeah, the kissy kissy three hundred, three homer. Dude, all the time Q. I am the plane. Hey, Chicane. And here come, here, here are the boys. The boys are back in town. It's not just me and Kyle anymore. It's me and Kyle and Junior and that Kinseth, I think. <clears throat> Lots of blue cars chasing after the mustard. Now I'm leading a bush race.
won't be leading the cup race until much later. Well, I, except that fucking, that Richmond debacle. I won't be leading the cup race for a while. Close enough, yeah. Oh, and another blue car enters the fray because Casey's uh, caught up. Dabu D, Dabu Dai, Dabu D, Dabu Dale. How dare you not keep up with my fucking almost 200 part LP? How dare? Well, that sucks. Okay. Stay on Junior's ass and hopefully I can, uh, keep my speed up. Not a real fan band. Yeah, I'm just gonna push Dale here. Okay. Didn't quite work out. I know, right? Like, what the fuck, Chicane? How dare you, like, have other interests other than exclusively watching my content? What the fuck? I am triggered. Watch all the videos they reviewed of like GT3. Yeah. Had to remind me that was a thing. Okay, we're clear. I'll be glad when the time comes when we do GT3. But I'm not going to deviate from my Grandmaster plan to do it. Because I have a Grandmaster plan. But yeah, blame Stone Free. Fucking fuck you, Jimi Hendrix. Is Stone Free so good? Why does it get muted everywhere? No, I've, I've seen it outside my house a couple times, Geracer. I know you're there. Can't fool me. Junior, please. I know you're Dale Jr. in 2004, therefore you like to run against the wall at Daytona and Talladega, but come on. Damn ultimate fan experience. Oh! Okay, I bump drafted a little too hard there. Um No he no he wasn't, Corvette. Junior retired after last year. Was it last year or the year before? I can't even remember now. Yeah, Q, he figured it out. I hurt my fan base if I hit Dale. I'm gonna start throwing beer cans at me now if I win this. Wasn't that what happened to Jeff Gordon at Talladega and like around this time in terms of the context of the game? Like, Gordon barely edged out Junior, and everyone just threw beer cans at him. Because how dare he beat the immortal Dale Earnhardt? But it's not Dale Earnhardt, it's his kid. It's Dale Earnhardt, damn it! Here comes Kenseth, suddenly. Hi, Matt. How you doing? Dale is God, man. Yeah. I fucking won in the yellow. When, that was, like, the early days of, like, them st uh, no longer racing back to the yellow, wasn't it? Because, like, gotta have every fucking five seconds Larry Mack explain. Now, when the yellow comes out, they freeze the field... They go back to the previous scoring loop because they freeze the field, so they gotta go back to the previous scoring loop. People are fucking angry. Not quite 05 USGP angry, but they're fucking angry. Good slide job on Junior. 
I'm waiting until like the last lap basically to strike here. I'm just I'm playing the waiting game. I mean that is true, Sam. Especially, you know, loyalist bandwagon fans. I'll wait for the time to strike and then Junior gets away. Wait a minute. This is not part of the plan, Dale. Get back here. I'm not saying all Dale Jr. fans are retarded. I mean, I'm a Dale Jr. fan. But I'm not, like, one of those Dale Jr. fans. The USGP incident was really interesting to watch live, because that's what I did. I was just like, ooh, this is not good. <laughs> Even my stupid 14-year-old pea brain like realized this is not good. <laughs> Especially when you have Bob Varsha giving a live PSA to people like, hey, if you have friends at the track, tell them not to throw shit on the track. Uh, that, yeah. <laughs> and his final lap. Hopefully I'm going to go for the turn three dive. Oh, my left rear is very worn. So here we go. What exactly happened? Basically, all the teams that were running Michelin tires boycotted the race because of safety concerns. I think Ralph Schumacher had a huge crash on the, like, the final speedway turn during practice or something. And they proposed to add a chicane right before the speedway, t the final turn, but Ferrari, I think, was the only team that, uh, like, turned that down. Also, I win. Yeah! First, first win in my first start of my own car. Woo. But anyways, uh, yeah, Ferrari was the only team to oppose it, so it didn't, they didn't do the chicane, so all the Michelin, uh, all the Michelin teams freaking just boycotted the race by, uh, pulling into the pits on the formation lap and never actually participating. I won $300,000 from that race, goddamn. Money. Holler, holler, get dollar. Did I lead the most laps? Yes, I did. Nine to Junior's eight, nice. Okay, well, I'm actually surprised that strategy worked out. Look, also, look at all these guys that started in the back that ended up towards the front. Hornaday, 40th to 7th. Martin, 35th to 8th. Sauter, 31st to 9th. Like, look at his shit. God damn. It's actually pretty crazy. Harvick ended up 20th. That's actually not as good as I was expecting him to do. Alright, well. There's the results. Let's scroll all the way down to 43rd now. I'm gonna check out the, uh, the highlights and uh, see if I can get a good thumbnail from the highlights. Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. Holy fuck, why do I have so few fans? Oh, I know why I have so few fans, because I don't have an ask a cup ride. So the game had to revert my fan numbers back. Okay, I gotcha. What's up, buddy? It's Ace here. Who loves you, baby? This is the big one. There's a Nextel Cup team that wants you to run a test session. Now, if you do well on this one, you're looking at the big-time driving contract. Check your calendar and season info. Confirm the date. Make sure you're there. Okay, well, got another offer for Cup Ride. Hopefully these are, uh... Hopefully this is a, uh, actual good team. Um, I'll go more into detail in the next segment, but... There we go. First bush race down. Also a first truck race down. So let's see how our drivers did. Where... How did you do, DJ? Oh, wow, he finished fifth. Good. Made 8,000 bucks from him. Awesome. And how did my truck drive out to do? Murphy, and finished 22nd. Eh, I'll take it. I'll take it. And then, let's see how my merch did in the Bush series. Probably charge more. Star in his hands. Items hot. Hot, hot, hot. Feeling hot, hot, hot. I think I'll just leave the merch at the price it is now, so because, just fuck it. So, trophy room. There we go, there's our trophy for the Hershey's Kisses 300. Also, you know, I actually changed my Xbox date to where it's accurate now, finally. 
finally. But yeah. So, that'll conclude this segment, and my fan number has reverted back to 5 million because I don't have a current active cup contract. Maybe that'll change soon, we'll see. But uh, next time, we'll check out that uh, cup ride, and also the ones that are offered in the postseason, so stay tuned for that. Thank you.